That's another conversation we need to have. The ticket men in London, do they do they rest? Bro, it's funny you said ticket that. Ticket companies, do I they saw, rest? I saw my boy um, snap the other day. <laughs> I, was, I was saying director, you know, the one that um, led <laughs> us to travel. <triathlon. laughs> he, he was something sitting outside his house and I was like, and he just <laughs> snapping the ticket inspector and the guy's just looking at him and he's looking at him for a good minute. <laughs> and the guy just going like this, he's like this. Shaking head, he's like, nah, you man, you man are bad. It just the guy looked so aye, it was funny, but yeah. No, we need to have an honest conversation about ticket men. I was at what 2 a.m. The ticket men are out, you know. Yeah, man, they're trying to get that money, trying to get their money. What area was it? I was um on Common Garden, so Denmark Street. Oh yeah, because that, that one finishes at eleven or twelve or something, isn't it? Something late. What, that area? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think so. Like but Covent Garden, Soho. A lot of the people are permit holders, residents only. Mm. Shoreditch is through the night. Yeah. Shoreditch, I got a ticket there at 3 a.m. I didn't read the sign properly. Like the very first time I parked in a spot and it said, it basically said don't park between 11 and 6. Whereas I, I thought 11 and 6 was free. <laughs> oh. How can it say don't park between 11 p.m. Yeah, and 6 bro, a.m.? There's certain but you roads, can park during there's the certain day. roads in Shoreditch. Bro, I'll, I'll come back There's to Road in Beckham, that's like 9 to 11, though. Is it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 9 you know, to 11 p.m.? You know what the roundabout is near the church, yeah? With the Tesco Yeah, yeah, yeah. Opposite that Tesco, that little side road. 9 to 11 on that side Hold road? Hold on, wait, yeah, wait, 9 wait. 9 to 11 p.m. What Tesco are we talking about? The you know, Express? You know, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah where the roundabout is. Yeah. The left the left before, the church is across the road. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The left so before. So you've got Odeon, church, and then Tesco. Tesco, and opposite the, the Tesco. Opposite Tesco, there's a road that there's goes round and it goes around the side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that, yeah, that's that one. that's because it's a service road. Is it? It's a road that services the shops. Ah, interesting. Wait, yeah. well, that's a back road though. Yeah, but it services that Nando's and that sort of stuff. Did not know that. As in, like, if, that's if, where... if I turn right onto that road and I try to park on the right, yeah, I can't do that. Actually. Yeah, because it stops in it. You can only do a left. Yeah, yeah I can only do a left to yeah. go back out to like the Nando's and that. Yeah, yeah. But if it's... I just stay in that little road bit. Then yes, you're done. Yeah. Yes, it's because it services all those shops. Crazy. That's why. Did not know that. And on the other side of that road, opposite it, the, where the Tesco is, where the quick fit or whatever that sh- that thing is, the garage, mm. the um, it's that's residents only for a certain periods of time. Yeah, <coughs> residents only. Yeah. But the guy, the ticket man, God bless him, didn't he? He saw my car, didn't give me a ticket. Yeah, there's some. He some said, of them yeah, I saw good. it twice, but it's it's fine. Oh, do you know? What I've, <laughs> I've told people to do like if you're parking someone you shouldn't for a couple minutes put your hazards on people think it's underestimated but it actually it worked for me a couple of weeks ago literally i can't remember where i went maybe somewhere in my lunch you know me i like to gallivant and then flipping i i always do it in a peak spot literally man just stood there and he he i saw him from like a distance but i was like shit and he just stood there waiting and come back and i was like thank you boss mm. a ticket man gave me a ticket and i and i paid i paid for parking I asked him, right. can I park here? This was in uh, by Shepherd's Bush, Westfield. I asked him, can I park here? He said, yeah, 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 yeah. I paid for parking. I went to I went to do, um, I went to do a recording, came back, had a ticket on my car. Ticket man was walking off. As, I, as I'm coming back to my car, the ticket, the ticket man must have stood there. For, I was gone for like an hour and a half, you know. Paid for parking for two hours. <clears throat> ticket man gave me a ticket. I was two minutes late to my vehicle. The man must have stood there and he literally gave me a ticket. He stole that countdown. Same ticket man I spoke to before I got out of my car and said, I'm going, gave me a ticket. Watch me park, watch yeah, me pay. He's a boss. Gave so. me a ticket. Boy, the way I was going to run, I was thinking about running him down at that point because I was like, bro, how can you give me a ticket when you know? And he's, those, he's and those tickets, money is money. I don't think them tickets are even real. I got, you know, the ones that you give you in West London? Um, the Westminster kind of ones. Mm. They're not yellow, they're white. And if you, you pay them half price, they're 40. It's 40, 40 minutes, They're 40 pounds if you I pay never, them half I've price. I've never got a ticket there, you know? Yeah. Not... I, that's just one bar I wouldn't think to mess around with. <laughs> but I paid for parking, and parking cost me 10 pounds for two hours. Jeez. Parking is expensive, anyway. Even Brixton is like the same price. I think Suffolk as well. It's like 11, 11 pounds or something, even for an hour in yeah. certain places. Bro. They're killing us with this shit, bro. Mate, More than killing us. 
because even when I go barbers, yeah, I part for like an hour, it's like five pound now. Where's your barbers? Brixton. Oh, okay, yeah, because Clapham's the same. Do you I have just the partner in Loughborough? The Ringo, but the it's it's pay pay by phone or something like that. Oh yeah, the Ringo, yeah. They they start to get cheeky. Crazy, then. Start to get cheeky, bro. They're doing the pre authorized and they're taking fourteen pound. In Battersea, they do that. <laughs> yeah, that's what? why my barbers they yeah, they yeah, take yeah. the parking. They'll take the whole thing. The whole thing. So say you're parking from nine till five. They might take twenty five pound out your account. Yeah, and then they'll, then they'll reimburse you. you. <laughs> <laughs> So like say eleven pound or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But they say that you have to pre-authorize the whole thing. The whole thing. So imagine you never had that money in your account. <laughs> yeah, they've sucked you, and you ain't. But that's not how much you're paying for. Yeah, that's not still. So it's nice. up. It's up to you to stop it when you leave. <coughs> and if you forget, get in your car, forget. You've been charged. Because you pre-authorized anyway. Because you think, oh yeah, I pay for it. Mate, that is long.